kannst du mal. Nee, 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 würde nicht. Mm -mm. <lacht> bye bye. Bitcoin, Blockchain, Cryptocurrency, all these words you have heard often enough, right? And that's what I wanted to talk about. But before that, I actually wanted to say one thing because I've now been asked multiple times why I always go out and go outside while I make these videos. And I don't know, like I spent most of my days inside my room just in front of the PC. So it's nice to kind of get out a bit, get some of the fresh air. And I kind of noticed that I can think better when I have this passive task, task of just walking while doing this because I never script my videos. I only think about the thing I want to talk about and then pretty much everything else is random. So it's helped me thinking. But the other thing, Bitcoin, blockchain, cryptocurrency, all words we have heard in the news often enough, right? And like, I've now spent the last couple of days getting educated a bit, a bit, because like, it's a big topic. It's a very complex topic, very complicated. And I'm not pretending to know a lot about it. And I also don't want to explain to you what blockchain is or anything like that, because I feel like there's so many resources you should check out. And because I also learned that way, right? Like Googling, going on YouTube, that's how we learn in this age. And there are so many awesome people who know so much about this topic, who are very smart in the way that they can communicate this very complex topic in, in relatively easy ways. But while I was learning, the one thing that always came back into my mind was, so I was reading, I was watching, I was learning, and I tried to go to edit from a as open-minded standpoint as I could be, as neutral as I could be, right? And always when I read something, I thought like, wait, if this is actually as good as they tell me it is, why do I hear all these things in the media, right? Like, Bitcoin is a bubble. Um, this is just a trend that will go away in the next few years. Like, that doesn't make any sense. Why, why does, like, it can't be as good as I think it is from reading these resources. But then, trying to not get killed, but then I found one video. And that video is from 1994, so before I was born. And it was from the Today Show, one of the biggest mainstream media shows in the USA. And they talk about the internet. And I want you guys to see this video. I can actually play it now. I wasn't prepared to translate that as I was doing that little tease. Oh, that's that right. little mark with the A and then the ring around it. At? See, that's what I said. Mm -hmm. Um, Katie said she thought it was about. Yeah. Oh. But I'd never heard or it. Around I'd never heard it about, said. About, I'd about, always about seen around. the mark, but never yeah. heard it said. And then yeah. it sounded stupid when I said it. Violence at NBC. <coughs> yeah, I heard it around or about. Fight the lunchroom the See, week. there it is. Violence <laughs> at NBC. GE com. I mean. Well, what well, Allison should know. What, what do you is say internet about anyway? Internet is uh, that massive computer right. network, mm -hmm. the one that's becoming really big now. What do you mean? That's big. How does one? What do you write to it like mail? No, a lot of people use it and communicate. With, I guess they can communicate with NBC writers and producers. Allison, can you explain what internet is? No, she can't say anything in ten seconds or less. Oh, <laughs> oh. Allison will be in the studio shortly. What, is, what does it mean? It's a, it's a giant computer network made up made up of uh, started from. Oh, I thought you were going to tell us what this was. It's so like a, look a in computer the dictionary. billboard. It's, it's not in it. It's it, it's it's. A... Okay, you've watched it. And after watching this video, it suddenly all made sense to me. Because you gotta understand, like, he said, what is internet anyway? What is internet anyway, 1994? Like, the internet had been around at that time for a couple of years, right? And like, I couldn't understand it because I'm from that generation that just grew up with the internet. The internet is the most normal thing. We do everything on it, right? We buy our stuff, we communicate with our friends, we play games. Pretty much 
all of what we do is on the internet and it's most the, in, the most intuitive thing to us we knew. But like mainstream media, after a couple of years after the technology has been out, like these people are like in it. Like these are not some people living on the countryside. Like these people are from the Today Show and they said, what is the internet anyway? And after I heard that, it all made sense to me. Blockchain, this technology blockchain, because blockchain is just an idea, right? Like, because there are different blockchains, like Bitcoin runs on a specific blockchain. It was pretty much the first one. Ethereum has another, another blockchain. There are now new blockchains coming out, Neo, EOS, whatever. It's just an idea, a concept. The technology behind all the other stuff, you know. Like blockchain, uh, Bitcoin is pretty much the very first application on this, um, on this technology. You can think about it as if Bitcoin is the very first website on the internet. And like, it just blew my mind because that is exactly what is happening. Like people, everyone said like the, the internet is a bubble. And like now you hear the same thing and it's repeating itself. And I thought like, now that makes sense. Now that's why to me it all, all sounded so um, amazing. And I gotta switch hands now. Right, because like that's what we do. We read these things in the mainstream, in the media. And we think like, okay, like these people are reporters. These people like spend a lot of time researching and really trying to get to know this stuff. And when they say, this is trend, this is um, a fad, this will go away, Bitcoin is a bubble, whatever, blah, 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 blah. Then we think, okay, there must be something to it. And I mean, it makes sense. Most of the time, they're probably right. But like, when we look at these things for ourselves, and that's what I did, and just look at it from an open-minded standpoint, because like for me, I always thought like, how can this be? from what I've seen, from what I read, from what I, like, the, the, the connections I made, like, it can't be that good, right? Because everywhere you hear, it's said otherwise. But it actually is that, that amazing. And it's not about Bitcoin, whether it's a bubble or not, it's about the technology blockchain. And all I'm saying is, if, you, like me, want to change the world. I feel like this technology is where it's at. I mean, there are other trends, AI, machine learning, genetics, but like blockchain, I mean, all the other stuff will probably go on blockchain. Like whatever AI system we will come up with will run on blockchain because it's the new internet. It's the platform. It's where everything is going to build upon. So please, please, just, I'm not saying to listen to me. I'm not saying to listen to the media or not listen to the media. I'm saying to look at it yourself if you're interested in that kind of stuff. Have an open mind and then make your own educated opinion on it.